Here we go, heavyweights coming down to the last match. Nicholas Jarvis for Reinhardt's. Andre Besaints for life, the number ninth ranked heavyweights in NAIA coming out to save this win for his life running Eagles. Andre Besaint. Nicholas Jarvis trying to complete the comeback win for the number two seeded Reinhardt Eagles. It is our first match that had a major decision finish and it went to Reinhardt. Two and a half minutes left here in the third, in, in the first, in our last match, heavyweights. It looks like we've got some blood time. Coach Omi Acosta and his assistants. Talking to Andre, get those shots going. Get that offense going. Just salvage a win here for Besaints, and life will make it to their second straight NWCA National Dual Final. And if Jarvis can pick up an upset, it will be the number two and the number one teams in the finals. Two nineteen left in the first period, our final first period of this duel. It's been a great one. Thank you for joining us here on Fox College Sports. I'm John Peterson, bringing you live play-by-play -play coverage of the semifinals match of the NAIA National Duels here in Louisville, Kentucky. Beautiful arena, great place to have these duels. The second straight year they've had them here, and they do a great job. Minute 50 left here in the first. Both wrestlers pushing and pulling. Back and forth, couple sh fake shots from each wrestler. A minute 34 left in this first period. Just your classic heavyweight match this far as Besaint gets down a lower level here. Definitely can see him being a very versatile and mobile heavyweight, but no points scored thus far. Minute five left here in the first. Collar tie, tight collar tie on the right side there by Besaint. Pushing and pulling Jarvis here on the side of the mat. 50 seconds left here in the first. Thirty-five seconds now, pushing and pulling. Both wrestlers with collar ties on their left side. Jarvis, and the collar tie once again, left side pushing. As Besaint circles right back into the middle of the mat. Trying for an underhook on the right side. Pushing Jarvis off to the right side now. 13 seconds left. Who will face Grandview in the final? Will it be life for the second straight year as Besaint gets around for a two-point takedown? As time expires in the first, Besaint gets a go behind. A big two-point takedown at the end of the first. Jarvis will, will pick down after Besaint defers his choice and gets a takedown very late in the first period. Two more periods left of heavyweight and Besaint leads 2-0. Now one point escape for Jarvis, 2-1. 2-1 lead here. For the life running Eagles, Andre Besaint, a crucial, huge takedown. Time expiring in the first. Giving him a 2-1 lead as Besaint will have his choice in the third period. One twenty left here in the second period. Stay on it. Stay on it. Stay on it. 
As Jarvis continues to push and pull of that collar tie on the right side. He's got to be thinking about trying a couple shots here. Doesn't want, want get, does not want to get dinged for stalling here. In a close match against Besaint. Besaint, though, doing a great job is when he knows he's on the side of that mat. He circles right back in the middle. Doesn't want to get dinged for stalling either. Do not want to put this match into the ref's hands. We're on 45 seconds left in the second. We've reached the halfway points of our last match of this barn burning duel. The semi-final duel between the Life University Running Eagles and the Reinhardt Eagles. The Georgia showdown here in Louisville to see who will make it to the finals against the Grandview Vikings. 23 seconds left here in the seconds. The Saints has that takedown late in the first. Now he gets dinged for stalling, though, towards the end of the second period here. Five seconds left. Here's a shot there by Besaint at the end. He'll get another takedown at the end of the second period. Will he get some back points? They will. Look at it. Besaint out of nowhere with five seconds left in the second gets a takedown. 4-1. 